today is just showing you Playtime with Ralph. Here he is, little rascal. Absolutely attacking that little bear. We have quite a few soft toys for him. Uh, one of them he demolished yesterday. I will add a video here to show you. The whole foam was everywhere. Um, oh, here he is, choking a little bit. What are you choking on, mate? Yeah, he completely destroyed that toy. I have it here somewhere, actually. Here, a little poor guy, completely. And now he's looking at it. You're not getting it. No, no. It was a squeaky toy. The squeaky part of it was completely destroyed, so that's in the bin. Um, I mean, I will try and see if I can mend this, but probably not. And then yesterday, I think he might have ate some of that foam because he wasn't feeling that great in the evening. So we're not giving it to him anymore. And then I created a little box of toys for Ralph because before that, his toys were scattered all over the room. And he knows that box is in that corner over there. He usually comes and picks his own toy like he's doing now. Uh, in the beginning, we thought he's not interested in toys, but he, um, I think he wasn't interested because they were scattered all over the room, like that one there. So they were all over the room and then he wasn't interested because of that. But now they're all in one place. And, um, oh, I think he's picking his favorite bone. Good boy, good boy. You found your blue bone. Let's see. Come on, come on, come. Yeah. No, don't want it. Okay. So he usually goes to that corner there and he picks up his toys um, and then he kind of starts playing with us. And then, yeah, look, this is what he does. So it's basically like a child. You have to pick the toys after him, after play time is done. Come on then. What toy are you picking? This one? Is that what you want? Come on then, come. No? But that's the one you picked. Not today. Not today, maybe. Are you gonna play with your toys? There he is. Oh, he picked up the same bear <laughs> uh, that bone we've got him I think it calls it's called yakers and um, let me show you uh, it's basically made out of milk or something and it we've got him this and he's been chewing this for ages and it's edible come on then you don't want it come on then um, he had that toy for ages, the little bone, and it's the most long lasting chew toy we've ever found that's edible. Um, so we've had this for, I think about a month now, and we, it's still pretty intact. I think this is actually the shape we got it in, and it's just a little bit there that he's bitten off, but it's pretty good. Um, you know, it keeps him busy for a long time, uh, it smells good, it's edible, so if you're trying to keep him busy or something, um, it's really good to give it to him. We do have a couple of interactive toys that you basically put your snacks in there and then he just needs to find the snacks. Um, he gets very, very impatient with these toys and he just, this one, he um, he just literally did this to him. Just turn it around and then all the snacks, snacks fell out. Uh, I think it smells of snacks, so. But this is the way they would pick it up, like that with their mouth, and then, yeah. It's really easy for him. I think it still smells of snacks. That's why he's, um, he loves it. Oh, we actually lost one. Um, and this one, yeah. <laughs> he's very aggressive with them. So yeah, he just kind of takes it away and then ends up chewing it somewhere in a corner, thinking there's snacks there. But he gets very, very impatient with these. Uh, but yeah, these ones, I think I like this one better than that one 
uh, because this one is just easy. You just pick this, put the snacks here, so it's not as easy for them to get the snacks. Uh, that one there is quite easy for him because maybe he's got like a long nose, so he just turns it around and then just eats it. So you just add snacks. He gets really excited for food time. He runs around you like this. You just basically close these. Okay, they're all done now. Come on then. Let's see what you got. Yes, good boy. That's one. Good boy. <laughs> Come on then. Good boy. out of there so there you go you just open it with this paw literally clever boy obviously this is what the room looks like after playtime toys are everywhere so as long as you collect them and put them in a little tub or little box somewhere aside then he will be then interested in the toys because uh, it's like I don't know, maybe he forgets that he had them and then he finds this little, you know, chest of toys and then he gets them um, and then he starts playing with them, which is really good and keeps him busy. Now he's back. He's back at it now. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope this was helpful, a little tips with the uh, toys and then play time with your dog. And I hope you liked watching Alfie playing with his toys. He's still doing it. Give this video a like if it was helpful subscribe to this channel if you want to see more videos uh, with the little tips about dachshunds about sausage dogs and just uh, little vlogs with ralphie see you in the next one bye bye